Well, tonight is the fourth annual Wine and Beer Festival at Headwaters Park. That's where we'll find 20 Little Lives' Jen Danzak to give us all the details of the event. Uh, Jen? Well, Melissa, wine and beer, nothing gets better than that. And then put it together with endless samples. This is insane here at Headwaters Park West. And right now joining me is Jennifer Vanderpool from Junior Achievement, who pretty much put this whole thing on. Tell me all about what's going on tonight. Okay, this is a Junior Achievement's fourth annual uh, Riverside Wine and Beer Festival. Um, it's a fundraising event for Junior Achievement. It helps us uh, purchase our programs, and our programs are specific to financial literacy, workforce readiness, and um, career skills. So we are really excited about the turnout tonight. This is um, this has sold more tickets than all four years, so we're really, really happy. And um, so we've got local wineries um, in the Indiana Wine Trail and then craft brewers and also some home brewers inside. We've got uh, Wine Down, they're new to the area, so they're right on the uh, Parkview Field. And so we're really excited. It's, it's like, and Kroger's here and Coke is here. We got free cheese. <laughs> oh my yeah. God, free yeah. cheese. 30. Cheese and crackers, Yeah, right? yes, it's $30 um, to get in tonight. So we're, we're open right now and we'll be here until 8.30 tonight. That so is fabulous. yeah, and you come on down. And there's also, uh, I see like a little comic strip booth uh, where you can get uh, your picture taken with a bunch of silly uh, costumes. So that's also fun. And live entertainment from a guitarist as well. So there's plenty of things to do, Melissa. And like she said, it's only $30 at the door. You get endless samples of beer, wine from all around here. And hopefully you can even take home a bottle or two. So uh, it looks like a lot of fun. And the, there's people pouring in like crazy around here. Yeah, I can just see you going over that photo booth and picking up some of those props, Jen, for sure. Uh, and of course, this is uh, all for a great cause. Absolutely. Yes, it's for the Junior Achievement of Northern Indiana and all the proceeds go towards them. So for better education for people around here. So it's great. All right. Thanks so much, Jen. Talk to you later. Coming up 